Hi everybody, welcome back. In this video, I'm gonna be talking about occlusion portal right here on the add components. I did talk about it in a previous video, but I was not sure what it was. So I was in that video, I was talking about other things like occlusion area and other things like that. But when I got to occlusion portal, I was not sure what it did. Uh, I figured it out. So let's just, I'm just gonna show you guys how or what it does. So for this to work, all you really need is to have an object that you want to use as an occlusion. So I'm gonna use this door. It's gonna be as the occlusion. And I do have a script on it. If we go over here to the actual door itself, I have a script that pretty much just plays an animation. The animation is just a door open, which just opens the door slowly. And it's nothing fancy. I just pretty much wanted to show what that occlusion portal does. So like I said, all you need, would need is your um, door or whatever. Go back to idle and you would have to go to your occlusion tab for that you could go to window rendering occlusion calling it will open up this tab and once you have this tab open make sure your door your actual door has an occlusion portal so this occlusion portal will be created and you could actually edit the bounds so uh, let me turn on gizmos so if you can't see anything because i turned off the gizmos right here it's a little handy trick or tip when your stuff gets cluttered now i'm just gonna make this occlusion portal just a little bigger than the door it doesn't have to be perfect it's not really necessary it just pretty much has to get the door how you want it or whatever area you want to pretty much occlude and if you guys are not sure what occlude is or occlusion calling it just pretty much means that anything that the camera does not see it will pretty much not render so it will not show and it will not take up so much memory so now once you have your occlusion portal just hit bake and it's gonna bake depending on how big your area is or whatever for this it already baked for us and if you can see i'm on the visualization tab and for this for you to be able to visualize it all you have to do is go to your game view and also your scene view and uh well you don't even actually need your your game view but if we go over here you can see some of the the actual game or map is actually has disappeared and the reason for that is because of that occlusion portal or actually now the reason that you can't see most of the game is not because of the occlusion portal but the occlusion calling now with this occlusion portal what we could do is we could actually with this tab still open we have to drag it down here so it could be still open we're going to go to our door and we're going to hit closed now as you can see more of our map actually disappears which will of course help with performance as well so now let's hit play and actually let me speak Split these views and now as you can see on this right side uh, disappearing depending on where I'm looking at so if I'm looking backwards anything behind me shouldn't really be visible now if I go up here and I open the door let me try this again so now when we go up to the door we open the door and as you can see we could see everything but now let's say we close this now you can see our scene is actually stopped rendering and it is actually showing blue because that's what we have as the camera if we change this we could see what our camera is rendering as the background so yeah that's pretty much what occlusion portal does it's just another way of pretty much another way of doing occlusion calling and being able to render and unrender your map and save on performance but yeah that's pretty much it for this video i hope you enjoyed this video all the assets that were in this video will be in the links down below the assets i did use were the low poly shooter pack free sample it's like a template it's by infamy games hopefully i said that right there's also the door the door i was using which was the door free pack ferrar which is by andrew andrew ferrar hopefully i said that one right as well uh but yeah that's pretty much it for this video hope you guys enjoyed it if you guys liked it that like button hit that subscribe button and anything you guys want to know leave it in the comments below once again thank you